Hello students, in this section we will solve question from the topic integral and from the subtopic evaluation of the integral by UV rule. So the question, integral is limit 0 to 1 tan inverse x by x dx and options are pi log 2 minus pi log 2 and minus pi by 2 log 2 and pi by 2 log 2. The integral is limit 0 to 1 and inverse x y x dx to solve this integral consider sin inverse x is equal to t on taking sign both sides we will get x is equal to sin t on differentiating both sides we will get dx is equal to the derivative of sin t is cos t so cos t dt and for the new limit at x equal to 0 and now put x equal to 0 in this we will get t equal to sin inverse 0 that is 0 that means t equal to 0 and at x equal to 1 at x equal to 1 we will get t equal to sin inverse 1. The value of sin inverse 1 is pi by 2 that is t equal to pi by 2. So the new limit will be 0 to pi by 2. Then integral will be become 0 limit 0 to pi by 2 in place of sin inverse x put t and in place of x put sin t and in place of dx put cos t dt. Then this will become t by sin t and cos t dt is equal to 0 to pi by 2 t dot since cos t by sin t is cot t. So it is cot t dt. Now Write this in next slide. So, this is integral 0 to pi by 2 t or t dt. To solve this integral, apply the uv rule. That is, if u and v are two given functions written in product form, then the integral is first function as it is integral of second function. That is, Consider this is first, this is second function minus integral of uh, derivative of first function that is u dash and integral of second function that is v. So, it is the formula that is uv root. So, applying this, consider this is first function and this is second function. And uh, first function as it is integral of second function that is. 40 dt element is 0 to pi by 2 minus integral 0 to pi 2 the derivative of first function that is t the derivative of t is 1 and uh, integral of cot t the integral of cot t is log of mod 90. dt is equal to now putting limit on solving this further t the integral of cot t is log of mod sin t limit is 0 to pi by 2 minus uh, on integrating this uh, since uh, this is the standard integral the value of uh, this integral limit 0 to pi by 2 log of mod sin t dt is minus pi by 2 log of 2 so now putting limit this will become pi by 2 log of 
not n pi two minus zero log not sine zero and minus same thing minus minus becomes minus pi by two log two is equal to since the value of sin pi by 2 is 1 and log 1 is 0 so uh, this quantity will become 0 0 and this is also 0 so this is 0 minus 0 plus it is pi by 2 log 2 is equal to pi by 2 log 2 so pi by 2 log 2 is the correct answer therefore option t is correct option. I hope this is clear. Thank you.